Hey you guys, good morning healthy people, happy 2019. So this month we're focusing on physical health, physical habits, and so the goal is to be physically active for 30 minutes a day. And again, uh, for 66 days is a good number to make something more of a habit and you can go further. It's either 21, 66, or 90. You want it to be a lifestyle, so the more you do something consecutively, the more likely it is to be part of your lifestyle. Um, and so 30 minutes per day, that can include a brisk walk. That might be a hit routine. That might be hiking. That might be kickboxing, swimming, whatever it is for you. I don't feel well right now. So, um, let's get through this. Today's journal prompt question is how can you encourage yourself to exercise and what benefits will you receive? We're going to journal about that for 30 minutes. Being that I don't feel well yesterday, I didn't do anything today. I'm going to walk. For 30 minutes I'm not gonna be doing any jumping around any hit routines or anything like that plus I got a lot of other stuff to do so I have to get back in the game get my head in the game which has been out of the game for a while to be honest with you guys if I'm being transparent and so one thing that I know is when I'm growing it's always uncomfortable I don't know where to fit I don't know what to do um, I'm just trying to get the lessons and things like that and and so I could get um, so that I can grow and move forward in my life. I need to, to have these things in order to be where and who I'm trying to be. So it's okay that they're happening. It's just uncomfortable. Um, and I always play these little mind games with myself. So I get to figure out what my triggers are and what my comfort is and what, what coping mechanisms work for that particular situation, right? Because for one situation, this coping mechanism may work. And for another one, this may work. So that's where I'm at right now. But I do want to share with you guys... The books, I went over them before. You can get this one. This is the Plan and Prepare book. This really is a good book for goal setting. I appreciate it. It has a Dear Future Me in there. You can write down your to-do list, your top three things you can do today. Um, this one is the one that we're working in right now. This one, is it's laid out a little bit different because of its intent. It's laid out the first two weeks are set up so that you can reflect on yourself. And then after that, you journal, but then you have to ask yourself each day, did you do the whatever your healthier habit was that you said you were going to do? So for me right now, it would be, did you journal? Um, yes or no. I could still add strength training and drinking water on there. And then I probably will put a low number because I'm not doing it at a level that I should be. Um, of course, I'm not strength training at all right now because I don't feel well. And drinking water in the winter, I'm not doing so great. I got my tea though. I have tea. Um, so this book is designed to help you stay on track and support you as you create healthier habits. I haven't decided what my 2019 habits are. I I got some other stuff that I know I have to work on, but as far as building habits, I'm not 100% sure. So you guys can get these two books to help you on your journal, on your journey. They're journaling books um, as you go into 2019. And then if you just want some books to take notes, this book and this bullet one is available as well if you just like to journal um, and be creative. Let's see. I think that's it. Uh, the books are available on Amazon. You could get them there. Some benefits for how do I encourage myself to work out? Um, I know that for me, it's part of my mental health working out. I work out first thing in the morning as early as I possibly can. Because if I wait, even though I have teenagers, they will interrupt my workout. <laughs> and I won't be able to work out as, like, as a high level when you answer so many questions. You're just, you're just not getting it in. Um, that's if I do it at home. If I go to the gym and they're up or messing around, then, you know, I got to worry about time and getting back. So I just, like, try to do it when I can have as much time to get a good workout in. And the benefits for me, I didn't lose a lot of scale weight. I lo I toned, I guess, or I lost inches. And um, I could see a difference in my muscles. I'm stronger. And what else? I have better stamina. And one more thing. I have better stamina. I'm stronger. Didn't lose a lot of scale weight. And I just feel better, like mentally. When I get my heart rate up, it clears all the whatever's in my mind. So... Hopefully you guys are able to journal tomorrow. I will actually journal with you more and not talk as much, but I did want to let you know that the workbooks are available and they are great. Um, wishing you guys healthier, happier habits. Talk to you guys soon.